Today is another mirror magic and movement day. Just about to set up. Okay, let me vlog now. Anyways, y'all. So I had my event today. Nobody showed up, but these two lovely girls made me feel a little bit better. <laughs> I still gonna go home and cry it out though. <laughs> but it's okay. But after she cried, I bet you something great come out of it. <sighs> Just gotta keep going. Just gotta keep going. Just gotta go. Anyways, we had got our aura picture taken. Oh Courtesy. Oh, show me show your aura. We gotta show. I gotta show you guys. I gotta show you guys a little quick. Okay. I'm always getting this. When I go home, I'm gonna show you guys. It's always indigo purple. So crazy. <laughs> I literally just exist. Ooh, it's a broke Oh, that looks amazing. I know you did I know you did something. Made it short and sweet. Yes. So one thing, one thing we gonna do, we gonna eat. 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 We gotta do chairs. Oh we gotta oh I mean I know that's right. <laughs> experience the last few weeks y'all will not believe me y'all will not understand or maybe y'all will I mean everybody's experiencing this eclipse season in their own personal way but for me child I man, Crying up a storm. First of all, my last mirror work class that I had did all this fancy stuff. Had the candles out. Aromatherapy had a little aromatherapy going on. And nobody showed up. trying to cultivate space and share something that I've been feeling called to share. It's not something that, like I'm taking inspired actions. I'm doing everything that is coming to me. Like in my, my way, I'm doing everything right. And then to like physically set up, put in work, arrange things, put in money, Facing my fears, because mind you, one of the reasons why I did not want to do events was because of this. I never wanted to experience hosting an event or a class and nobody show up. Like that was like one of my biggest fears and it happened. And when I say I needed like a whole three days to just toss and turn, cry, be disappointed, question myself, being a bed. <laughs> yeah, I was in the bed, okay? Questioning myself, just not, not happy with the outcome of something that I really felt like would have went well. And I say that to say, after I allowed myself to cry, to get upset, to be disappointed, to be hurt. I gave myself the opportunity to like, look at it from a different perspective. Like one of my biggest fears happened and I experienced it and I'm still alive. <laughs> Before the day of the class even came, I already decided that I wanted to take a social media break. I want to take a break just from everything for a while to just, you know, get really focused on things I had set up and 
when the class came when the by the time the class came and nobody showed up i was just like oh fuck this <laughs> like it came from oh, i'm gonna take a social media break so i could just set up and be more focused i mean it's still that direction but it's more on some i do not want to put myself in spaces where i'm sharing a certain amount of energy a certain amount of love a certain amount of information and I'm not even being reciprocated. It's like I'm talking to a wall. I'm not, I'm not out for just using up my precious energy for things that, for people that's not gonna even see me, that's not gonna recognize me, that's not even interested in what I have to say. If y'all don't care about what I have to say, y'all don't care about what I have to post, if y'all don't care about my memory work classes, I could take my ass somewhere else. That's what I did. I kid you not. I told myself I want to quit like and not to be on some like soft ass can't take the heat type of shit I just I've been through it for a very long time especially when it comes to the matters of my career and love but we don't talk about that another time we talk about career right now I've been through the mud and to see myself get the courage to take the leap the way I did and for me to feel like I fell on my face, that shit, it, it, was like a, it was like a reality that I was just like, I hope I would never have to experience, but I'm happy it happened. I'm happy I took a leap out of faith and I'm happy that I was able to know what it felt like to want support and did not receive it. Know what it felt like to experience what I experienced. Moving forward, I feel like that's, that was the worst of the worst that could happen to me in regards to my career. What the fuck? <laughs> so hell yeah, I'm gonna continue to do my mirror work classes. I'm gonna continue to show up. This time with more insight, um, more clarity, more direction, more organization, and more easeful. Like I, I really don't believe I have to sacrifice my well-being to get to where I wanna go. I don't believe I have to force people to see me to get to where I gotta go. I don't believe I have to be more or do more than what I already set out to do. I'm just gonna continue to show up. The girlies is like, you'll see who your real friends are when you have a business. <laughs> no joke. I haven't seen any of the people that will, will talk to me about their business or people that I would consider my close friends. I haven't seen them show up. I haven't seen y'all show up. I haven't seen you guys show up. So it's really, it was, it was really eye opening for me. Uh, people be like, oh, they're gonna show up to my next class. My next class come, crickets, crazy. But it's cool. I don't have to like what I produce, but damn, a little in words of encouragement. Damn, a little friend, a little, hey, how you doing? A little, you know, it would, it would go a long way. It would go a long way. If you ride with me, I gotta work for the both of us. I'll put you in the driver's seat. Don't gotta hurry and I'm in the love. When you ride with me, gotta worry when tomorrow comes. I'll put you in the driver's seat. Don't gotta hurry now, cause we stay in control. In the Hey guys, let's see if they took the book. Ah, they took the book. Like, I'm so excited. The perfect alignment. If you ride with me, I gotta 
burn for the both of us I put you in the driver's seat Don't cut a hurry in the middle of When you ride with me